Hello friends, Pulki this side from Gadget Generations and today I am here bringing you a review for this latest earphone from Sennheiser, the Sennheiser i200, released uh, around the first week of February, I guess it got released on the 1st of February itself, I got it near the release date, I have posted an unboxing video for the same on my YouTube channel, uh, it was posted a few days back and I have been spending a lot of time with this beautiful pair because it just sounds amazing. So without wasting any more time, let's get done with the uh, review. Let's start with the review. I have all I have already been done with the unboxing. You guys can check that out from the link in the description section below. I will first of all talking about the design and build quality for the i200 in this review video. So let's begin with the design and build quality. So guys, here is the i200 with me in my hands. I have been spending the past week with this beautiful pair. It's just uh, amazing to listen to music on it because it just sounds effortless. So talking about the design and build quality, I will be including some B-rolls in this section because the pair is so small that I, whatever I try, I won't be able to get proper focus on these uh, while I'm speaking. So the pair has a really compact build. It's uh, It shares the design with other i series earphones that got recently released like the i900, the flagship from Sennheiser, the i300, the i600 and now the i200. It is one of the most affordable pair in the, uh, in this lineup right now. Uh, priced at 15,000 Indian rupees or about 150 US dollars. Uh, this uh, uh, this is uh, they are able to make a compact because it shares the same driver as well from the other uh, models in the series it shares a 7 mm micro dynamic driver unit and closed in a plastic shell this one has complete plastic build uh, the shell is matte black in color and has the traditional Sennheiser logo placed on its uh, placed on its face cover area a pair itself provides a very comfortable fit along with the good isolation at least to me uh, although I would like to say that the stock tips were not very were comfortable but they were not uh, you know very good sounding in my opinion so I switched them to these mushroom tips I will be adding the b-roll so that you can check that out from a closer look in this section apart from the mushroom tips these are not easily available in India I got these from Amazon Japan you can also try Ezla Sedna Earfit Lite it also improves the sound as well as the fit and comfort for the pair about designing build, there is not much to say because it looks identical to the i600 and the i300 and the i900. It just has a complete plastic build with a matte finish. In my opinion, it looks very simple and uh, a little bit of texture would have been better, but uh, you get what you get. So the, in terms of design and build, you get a simple looking pair, which is very compact and fits and sits nicely and comfortably into your ears and will be giving you a very good fit. Uh, about uh, I will be covering the driving section over here in this uh, section as well about powering up the i200 you don't need it works well off a smartphone but with a dedicated DAC and amp or a dedicated digital audio player it sounds wonderful it gets an improved presentation uh, with a dedicated musical source so that's it you it would shine with a good uh, source it has a comfortable fit and it has a simple design now on to the main part that is the sound quality part so let's begin and we will discuss about how this baby sound so coming towards the sound quality part for these little babies they sound wonderful at least to my ears they have a neutral tone that uh, presents you with an open and lively lifelike sound experience you get to hear a decent lower end performance the, the sound overall has a slight focus on the mid range slight focus on the mid range i won't call it a mid centric uh, im but it its mid range is a little bit focused and more pronounced compared to the lower end and the top end the lower end basically has some kind of uh, a hint of boost in the mid bass region it's not overly punchy or uh, hard hitting uh, it's uh, it maintains a neutral response but just a tad bit of punch that uh, adds up adds a little more impact that is present in the mid bass region especially with the stock silicon tips uh, i will uh, also when i switch the tips to asla or these jvc mushroom tips uh, the sub bass response is also a bit improved and is pronounced uh, uh, in a better way uh, coming towards the mid range the mid range sounds lively it uh, just delivers some of the best vocals that i have heard around this price point i would say because the vocals they just sound amazing 
the vocals have a neutral tone to them both the male and female vocals they are pronounced in a good manner they are uh, they create sense of intimacy for the listener with the i200 it just uh, it's just amazing for vocal lovers i would say that because i personally love listening to some good vocals I, like my artists my test tracks always include uh, tracks by damian rice by gloria gaynor and by tony braxton uh, so the pair just uh, does justice to them with the delivering amazing vocal performance travel as we reach the travel travel response is quite smooth it is inoffensive it just doesn't sound offensive at all e- even uh, i don't uh, you know i don't listen to growling or uh, heavy metal music because they just sound piercing to me in, in some of the earphones i'm a little bit sensitive in the travel region but uh, with the i told i could uh, enjoy some <laughs> Linkin Park, the older Linkin Park tracks like Crowling and all those and uh, they were just simply presented in a very good manner because the travel response is quite smooth. It just doesn't have any kind of harshness or sibilance present anywhere in the output. I just love that in i <laughs> It just sounds smooth. It just like sounds like a smooth ride. You just listen to music and it's just going on and on and you you and all of a sudden you notice that it's been two hours you have been listening to the music and it, it actually happened with me with the i200 when i was listening to this on my sony zx707 so it's an amazing set in that regard it uh, uh, if i have to sum up sum it uh, give you a summary of its sound i would say that it has a neutral sound with a uh, smooth and neutral like b- neutralish bass response with the slight bit of hint in the mid bass region the vocals are the main attraction of this pair instruments oh i would i just forgot to mention that instruments have precise imaging and uh, absolute uh, brilliant detailing in the for the pair so well that's uh, about uh, the summary for the sound part now talking about the dynamics uh, i tuned has some decent dynamics it uh, delivers a good amount of details i won't uh, say that it has a lot of micro details but it manages to retain a lot of uh, decent performance with a good amount of macro details in your sound also the instrument sound well separated and they have a good amount of air between them the sound stage is also pretty decently wide and uh, although it has an intimate and immersive factor because the vocals are a bit up front and uh, take the all the attraction on the stage so that's there well that's about the sound that I have that i like in the i200 now some of the things that i don't like uh, i mean some of the cons that i don't like about the i200 uh, sound especially talking about its sound quality part first of all the sound might sound a tad more neutral a, a little flatter for some people i would say that but uh, on, only on the stock ear tips i would like to mention that over here Try, if you really have an i200 i absolutely recommend you to get these jvc uh, the i call these mushroom tips but they are something like epf something uh, like i would add the link in the description section below it is a uh, uh, these are mush- I call these mushroom tips. These are available only on Amazon Japan. So with these, the sound is a lot more open, and uh, the sub bass is a lot more improved compared to the stock silicon tips. So these are uh, these get my absolute recommendation. And also, if you don't like to import from outside, you can get uh, you guys can get the Asla Sadna Earfit Light because that uh, really uh, these two really improve the output for the i200. Uh, so the output might be a tad bit more, uh, much more neutral for some listeners and also for some people might find the treble of the i200 to be, you know, overly smooth or uh, something like that. But for me, it just sounds perfect. It just checks all the boxes. It is decently detailed. It has a, a good level of resolution. It have, has precise imaging and it just sounds uh, like a, the perfect earphone I wanted for my day to day sessions. So that's about the sound quality part from my side. Now I would like to compare it. I would like to compare it with the show, Let's Show S12. That was a single dynamic driver IEM. The single planar magnetic driver IEM. Sorry, my bad over there. It has a 14.8 mm planar magnetic driver. And this one, this li- these little babies just have a 7 mm uh, micro dynamic driver. So how do these compare? So first of all, the S12 
S12 has a lot more punch to its output. It sounds fun and engaging in its output. On at the same time, the i200 has a more relaxing and a more neutral-like presentation. Uh, you know, you always you don't always want a fun session for listening. Just wait a second. Someone is making a law, or someone was out there making a lot of sound. Sorry about that. And my mic is sensitive. It just has picked up that voice. So. We're talking about the uh, comparison with let's show rest well that's well house is a 14.8 mm planner magnetic driver these just have a 7 mm micro dynamic driver they have a planner these have a dynamic i said it correct right yeah so the s12 has a fun and engaging sound it has a lot of punch in the lower end and it has a lot of details in the higher end as well at the same time the i200 these sound relaxing and comfortable for longer listening hours you have a new if you want a neutral like sound presentation these are the one that i would recommend s12 although s12 is also good it has a, some excellent presentation in the lower and its bass is quite punchy and dynamic it just sounds richer uh coming towards the comparison in mid-range the mid-range wise i20 is my absolute favorite its vocal presentation is something uh i would choose over anything else say in this price point and i'm not joking in that regard because the vocals of these pair are these is just simply amazing i just love them well that's about my comparison with the s12 basically the uh, if you want more fun more engaging a powerful bass response uh you would you would be better with the S12, let's show S12. But if you want a neutral like presentation with lovely mid range response and a relaxing, comfortable sound, these are the one I would recommend. So that's about it. Uh, I hope uh, you guys like this uh, video review of mine for the i200. These are absolutely wonderful set with uh, some excellent bass response or oh, with some excellent uh, neutral like sound presentation i hope you guys like this video of mine and uh, do subscribe to my channel as well thank you so much hello friends i, I actually forgot to mention uh, one of the cones in the video uh, the thing is that the cable has been replaced now instead of the older generation ones that have a sticky feel to them the new generation cable has a braided look to it and it is actually quite better than the what we had with the previous generation cables but it still has some microphonic issues uh, it's still not uh, damp perfect uh, although it's still uh, it's a lot better than what we had with the previous generation cable so i am having good thoughts that in the uh, next uh, iteration for any of the iems they will be including these braided cables and they are good and better than the previous ones well that's the only thing that i wanted to add to the video thank you so much i hope you guys leave a like on this video and do subscribe to my channel as well thank you so much